Alrighty, so we are back with another stage of the Blue Zone, boys. We've got the final stage of the Supreme Magnificent Battle. This is stage 7 versus Trunks and Goten. And looking over the information of this fight, it actually looks kind of fun. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, now, one thing I will tell you right off the bat, there is no like 3 million super attack. But this second phase actually has uh, a lot of fun mechanics that I think are going to make for a pretty interesting fight. So um, let me go ahead and break this down for you in the most simple way that I possibly can. Um, let me see if I can actually show you. Uh, yeah, so no, I don't. I, yeah, so you guys can see that um, with this fight, there are traps laid on the battlefield. And you might be wondering, Vilify, what the hell is that? Uh, I'm happy that you asked. Uh, what those are going to be doing uh, specifically is lowering our HP if we grab them. And Trunks has the ability to actually uh, change tech key spheres to AGL key spheres. So, what we want to do is avoid the, uh, the key spheres like that. <laughs> so that way it never hits us or we don't take that damage, right? And the same thing is going to be happening if we... Uh, in the next phase with physical key spheres. So I actually, ooh, she seals. Okay. Yeah, so now Beast Gohan, unfortunately, is not going to be damaging Goten on this specific turn. But uh, Goten is going to be enabling this uh, effect of the AGL key sphere stuff. So we need to get rid of Android 18. That's, that's a, a must. That's a no-brainer, right? Android 18 is going to provide a lot of issues for us. Uh, with that ability to seal Beast Gohan at slot one, uh, just we're losing out on a lot if we don't have uh, those effects in. But UI Goku is going to be able to do some decent damage to her, I would imagine. Uh, shouldn't be the end of the world here for us, so do keep that in mind. Uh, yeah, cool, cool, cool. Now, Burori um, is going to be a decent help here, right? I brought Himzel on the team because we just need to get rid of some of our physical characters. And one thing uh, that's going to happen in the next phase is... Um, the Trunks and Goten disable the effect that changes key spheres, right? And they also disable damage reduction. So two different things uh, that were not present in the last fight uh, make this for a fun little kind of like gimmicky fight. Again, I don't see a super that's hitting for like 4 million in here. So Beast Gohan, it still should kind of be like um, the LeBron meme where he's like flinching back, right? Um because of uh, the like disables damage reduction, but that could be a, a potentially be a little bit problematic for some other characters on the team. So uh, it'll be interesting to see how that goes. Uh, again, I had to take off some of the physical characters that I had on the squad last run, uh, just because I wanted to make sure that we were like we were okay here, right? So should be good to go. Uh, I did set this up in a decent way, uh, and we could still potentially avoid all of those orbs uh, if we play our cards right. So we want to grab this one right here with you. We want to grab, who do we want to go after? We need to get rid of Android 18. So I just want to focus on Android 18 with uh, Tech UI. Like we just need to get rid of Android 18. That's that's the big focus for me. And then we will go after Trunks here with Vegeta. So hopefully Android 18 doesn't uh, super again. It's lot one, I could talk now <laughs> and we're good to go, right? So that should be uh, all she wrote for 18 and we should be good to go. Excuse me, I had to take a drink. <laughs> so 10 million uh, right there. We, um, I don't know how much trouble we're going to be in in the next phase, uh, but so far, I, I, I kind of like what they're trying here. What I really think that they've done well with this worldwide download celebration, um, you know, there's going to be a lot of negative talk about it, and I do understand that. With the content, I don't think this has been the best ever. But one thing that I can say positively about this worldwide download celebration is I like the things that they've been trying with the new events, right? Uh, they haven't all come to fruition, but if you combine some of these mechanics that they've been putting in, you could really have, like, a monster difficult stage at some point. I don't know if this is going to be the celebration that has it, but, like, 10th Annie Power Creep, uh, we could potentially be seeing some crazy stuff. So, I'm excited to see that. But I don't know if specifically in this celebration where you're going to be seeing, like, the the craziest Power Creep of all time or anything like that, right? That is just uh, one thing that I've noticed via doing this. Uh, but let's uh, let's see things out. <laughs> see if um, how these uh, trap orbs are going to be playing out in the next phase because we do have 
another set of these to deal with in the next phase, but their HP just really isn't that high. It's only 80 million in the next phase. Like, I know that seems like 80 million. That seems like a lot. It's, in 2024, it's really not, right? <laughs> like, all right, all right. I could see Orange Piccolo being a little bit of a problem. Now, unfortunately, this is where things are going to be tricky, right? We've we've danced around it. We've uh, we've done the, the, the jiggy with it. Uh, we are going to have to take 200,000 damage here. We don't have a choice. Uh, this is going to hurt. But again, like I said, we just we just don't have a choice. So go ahead. Yeah, that stinks. But we just got to get it out of the way. Uh, let's go after Trunks with you because a potential triple super triple crit might put him in the the danger zone so we'll do that and we'll do this so if he supers piccolo we're probably in trouble uh but that is just the way things go sometimes so uh we're gonna get rid of go 10 right here hopefully uh our boy beast comes through for us here does the damage that we need him to do and then we will be good to go um sucks that we had to eat that super though or that basically like that super attack worth of uh damage from the um the thing right <laughs> from the bombs uh, sometimes, you know, because of the fact that we weren't able to change those, um, we were able to change them in the first phase, but the second phase we won't be able to, so I just took off my orb changers. Um, it's just uh, unfortunate, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. The Trunks' is, uh, attack is only 330,000, so, like, those normals are not going to absolutely shred Piccolo, I, don't, I, I can't imagine they would. Uh, and then UI Goku. Who did I put UI Goku on? Did I put him on Trunks? I did. Yeah, so the triple super triple crit, hopefully we need that. And then uh, Piccolo will actually... I don't believe... I forget which one it is of his that uh, lowers his attack. I think it's the 18 key lowers his attack. So we do have to keep that in mind. Um, but we're, we got rid of 18. That was the whole... Uh, that was the objective there. Just to make sure that we did because we did not want to deal with that. Uh, yeah, 2.9. This Piccolo is not Link level 10 yet. He, I coined him on the Zero to Hero account, so this character is not going to be perfect, but it should be enough for what we need. Uh, yeah, we're good. Double digits on those, we'll be fine. Okay, cool. Uh, this is Goten's. No, this is Trunks'. All right, how much is this going to hit us for? 40,000? Ooh. Okay, so now... Yeah. Whew, look at all those AGL orbs, man. <laughs> okay, let's... Uh, how do we want to do this? How do we want to dance around the AGL orbs? Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> that's, uh... That's not good. <laughs> that is really not good. We we need to finish this fight, and we need to finish it now. <laughs> that's, we gotta get out of this phase, man. <laughs> Look at all of those AGL orbs. I think that would just take us to 1 HP. Right? 40,000 per? Uh, it depends on how many we, how many there are. I'll, I'll see if I can get a look. I don't know if I'm going to be able to though. Um, yeah, I can't see the orbs anymore. Just it, it, here, you want to answer? It's a, it, it's a whole lot. That's that's your answer, right? That, that that's exactly what it would have been. A whole lot. <laughs> so cool, cool, cool. Eleven million. Yes. Thank you, Beast, for getting us out of that fight. I did not want to deal with that. Okay. So, like I said, we are now in the second phase of our endeavor here. Who do we want to get rid of? So damage reduction has been disabled. We have a revival. So right now things are going our way. Um, we want to get rid of Trunks and Goten first because they are doing the most. So Evolution Blue Vegeta, you go right here. UI Goku. Oh, I always forget that's an AOE. UI Goku, you go right here. And now we get to work Beast Gohan. You go ahead and do your taunt. And we get to work. So we're going to grab these with Evolu or with Beast Gohan. We're going to grab these for the healing with UI Goku. And then we're going to grab these for the other slight bit of healing with Evolution Blue Vegeta. Now, again, this does disable damage reduction, but it's only 9.8 or 9.8. It's only 980,000. We have guard. We have defense. We should be okay. Yes. So... The whole idea that we need to work around here, and Krillin's is oh, Kurilin is uh, 1.2, so again, not going to do too much. Uh, we just need to get through this phase, right? We need to get rid of uh, Trunks and Goten, and then once we get rid of Trunks and Goten at their 80 million HP threshold, uh, we can just lock in on our boy Krillin, and we should be able to kind of just put him away. So this fight is doing a lot of things, but I just don't think that these supers were cranked up hard enough. 
to the point where it was like, oh no. So both of these fights to me, um, from what I could tell, were gimmick fights. And the no item runs were fairly simple for them. Uh, the category missions might be a bit different, but for now, I just want to focus on getting the initial clears in, getting the initial no item runs done. Um, and we will be good to go. I just want to make sure that I cover the stage. Uh, the JP account is more of where I focus on the category missions because I am a little bit of a superheroes merchant or like a, you know, Beast Gohan team merchant on the global. But I figure that you guys would enjoy the global gameplay a little bit more than the JP gameplay. So that is why I'm recording the global runs first. And then off camera, I'll do the JP stuff or do it on stream. So there we have it. Now, we still do have a Krillin to get rid of, but... Um, I don't foresee too much of an issue here. I think Evo Blue can take care of business for us here. Uh, 18 million. If we triple super, triple crit, uh, we'll definitely be able to take care of Goten and Trunks right here. And then it is just going to be a race to get rid of Krillin. Yes, Goten and Trunks. Your day is done. You lasted one turn. Uh, there will be no... Today, there will not be a dethroning of Goku and Frieza on JP. There will not be a dethroning of the original Red Zone Broly. Uh, we, we de This is definitely not going to be a hardest fight contender. Uh, no dodge disabling, no rotation locking equals probably pretty easy. That's that's the verdict here. So, um, how do I want to do this? Let's let's get the guaranteed dodging in right here. All right. We don't even need the taunt. That's I'm I'm feeling pretty confident right now. I got my I got my swagger going. Right. I'm feeling good. Uh, we do also have an action break. So I'm not I, like that's why I said I'm not feeling like we need to use the. Uh, you know, the 20-minute Ghost Usher here with Orange Piccolo, uh, we'll be fine. We will be fine. So, UI Goku, go ahead. Get your counters in. Do your thing. I like your cut. Smack this Krillin on top of the head. It should be bald, but he has hair for some reason. <laughs> We're getting the damage out of the way. Nice. No crits there, but uh, now that we are doing our super attacks, uh, he should be doing a little bit more damage now. So, we should be good, right? It's just a slow race to the finish. Getting rid of Goten and Trunks got rid of all of the uh, the funky business, right? This Krillin is doing nowhere near as much as what Goten and Trunks were doing. Let me just read this to you, right? Enemy receives 6% of enemy's match HP, max HP as damage per physical key sphere obtained. Uh, will not be KO due to receiving this damage. Reduces damage received. Deactivates the effect that reduces damage received. Changes as TR key spheres to physical key spheres. And deactivates the, phys the uh, effect that changes key spheres. So we couldn't rainbow warp change, right? And then Krillin nullifies super attack ceiling effect. Disables attack and defense reduction. And grants immunity to being stunned. So he is a very, very cookie cutter boss here. AKA, your boy's got nothing to worry about. We just have to uh, whittle our way through here, take it slow, and uh, we'll get done. Because uh, a 1.2 million super attack is not taking us out. Not this team. No way. Not the squad that we are bringing to the table. No chance. <laughs> so, final thoughts. Uh, superheroes team, unfortunately, not tested here. Um, but just for the sake of making sure that we got the video out and ready to go, uh, we just ran a team that's not going to make things too hard on us, uh, and we can go ahead and finish up. So let me know down below, uh, what you guys think of this specific stage. Um, we got to move on to the other stuff for like the wallpapers, uh, after this, I guess, um, maybe we'll do a video on that. Maybe we won't, but I definitely wanted to make sure that I covered both of the blue zone stages. So. There we have it. Uh, will this be the final blow? It will be. Uh, let me know, like I said down below, what you guys thought of this specific event, these stages, all of that fun stuff. Uh, it's been fun. You know, Blue Zone typically tends to be the harder events, but uh, this one was not that. <laughs> there you go. So if you did enjoy today's video, uh, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you are new so you don't miss out on any of the Dokkan content we're posting around here. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching as always, and I'll see you in the next one.